Greetings, my name is Austin McDowell, a meteorologist with the National Weather Service in Great Falls, Montana. I will be presenting this week's Thursday weekly weather briefing for the week of February 10th through the 16th. Let's begin. There are three concerns over the upcoming week. The first will be gusty winds across much of central and north central Montana Thursday. The second and third will be weather systems producing precipitation passing through the region. The most impactful weather in the near term will be gusty winds along the Rocky Mountain Front, Central and North Central Montana. Gusty winds should last into the evening before subsiding overnight. Patchy blowing dust will remain possible, primarily in the afternoon Thursday along the Rocky Mountain Front and into the plains. A cold front and upper level support will allow for precipitation across North Central and Central Montana late Thursday night into Friday. The expectation is for rain initially before transitioning to snow as the cooler air filters in. The main impacts are expected to be limited to the Kings Hill and Lewistown areas, where minor impacts are expected due to snow. Otherwise, a dry weekend is expected before a second precipitation producing system moves in Monday afternoon or evening. Impacts with this system are low confidence at this time, but primary impacts would generally be light snow across much of the region through Wednesday. Snow would be more impactful at past level compared to lower elevations. Let's first start off with temperature trends across the region. A cold front is expected Thursday night, which will bring temperatures back closer to average in most areas. Then, downslope winds return Saturday, bringing high temperatures back above average through the weekend into early next week. A second cold front arrives Monday night, bringing temperatures back down to near normal for this time of the year, Tuesday and Wednesday. Gusty winds are expected initially along the Rocky Mountain front Thursday before spreading over the plains during the day. High wind warnings have been posted to cover expected impacts. Winds will subside by the end of the day Thursday. Thursday night and Friday system is expected to be relatively minor from an impact perspective. Initially, light rain will be the main player, but as cooler air filters into the region, most precipitation is expected to transition to snow. Accumulations on the order of two to three inches looks likely in the Kings Hill area, with an inch or two likely in the Lewistown area through Friday afternoon. There is a good amount of uncertainty at this point for the system next week regarding both timing and magnitude of precipitation. The main takeaway, however, is that precipitation, mainly in the form of snow, is increasing in likelihood with this system. Snow would likely most, be most impactful at past level. Temperatures will also be much closer to normal thanks to a cold front dropping through the area Monday night. Stay tuned for updates regarding this system next week. Widespread drought conditions continue throughout the region. A season of well above normal precipitation will be required to reduce these current conditions. The current 8 to 14 day outlook favors near normal precipitation for central and north central Montana, while southwest Montana is leaning below average. Temperatures look to be leaning above average for this time of the year region wide. This wraps up this week's weather briefing. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to contact our office or visit our website or social media sites. Otherwise, thank you for listening and have a great rest of your day.